Okay, what's up everybody? I'm here to unbox XCOM. I want to show you guys how it looks like from the inside. So this game just came out on a Tuesday, I believe the 26th. So the game got pushed back for a little bit. But uh, just give me a second to open the thing here. I'm doing this one-handed, so. Ooh, you got that fresh box smell. You know, I was at the... Uh, Best Buy and I get this game for $47. $47.99 with tax. That's the original retail because I'm part of the gamers club there. I know the services have that as well. But I don't mind driving it the same day instead of waiting for Amazon to ship. If you're indecisive, you can just get it that same day. And I got it at a good price. And they came with the $10 gift card, so that's pretty awesome. So here's the game box so you can see. It's a dog right there. Uh, so it, it takes uh, 22 gigs, so make sure you free up space. One player. Uh, I've heard it's the same one as the PC version, so you have to be very... If you have the PC, you probably would have the same one here. So, ooh, you got that new video game box smell. Smell it with me. Oh, it smells nice. It's a factory sealed ink and box and games. So what is this? Cool! I get this. A resistance warrior pack if you play the PC you, you know what this is you get a little cool extra costumes for your characters I know there's gonna be other DLC here's a little booklet they give you Battleborn uh, make sure your health is good you don't play it on an empty stomach a lot of text and it's all in English because this is America and we got it in American Best Buy so here's how the disc looks like Bang. Bada bing bada boom. There it is. It's your XCOM. And there is no inside art cover, so you know, just be prepared. You know, everyone's trying to save money, be economical. Be nice to have it, but that's cool. And uh, that's basically the unboxing here. So yeah, that's that's part of the unboxing there. That's the PS2 version. Um sorry, PS2, <laughs> PS4 version. And you got the little cool book right there. Yep, and the little DLC code, PS4. Now that that's basically it. And I just want to compare it really quick because you know I'm a nerd. I'm gonna have obviously PC and and the PS4 console. You know I don't care if I can get a controller and play it on the PC. PC is not too accessible for me too often, so I, I actually like my PS4 more. I'll just show you a little cool com comparison. I got the little collector's edition, or maybe just the regular edition. Now you got that. Hey, what's up? You know, it has like a little cool 3D thing. See that? I actually like personal. I like the, the PC. Look at that. Ooh. All the skulls. These are actually human skulls. I think that's really cool. And then you just got the, the plain box of the game. And came with the same Resistance Warrior pack. Dang. There's no DLC code. I think you just... They just give it to you. And you just add it on your Steam. I don't really care about that. You can have this if you want, whoever sees it, sees it. And then this one actually had like, what, six discs in there? Let me show you how, the disc looks the same if you actually compare the two as well. I don't usually get two of every game like this, but I usually just, you know, I like this game. I was a big fan of the originals and the DLC, so there's no real difference in the PC disc. They all look the same. Let's see a little, little brighter but you do got that blu-ray and this is just regular dvds you don't really need these cds after you install the game so but yeah yeah that's what's cool and i want to show you that comparison so hopefully you guys check that out but i think i'm gonna like it better on the ps4 because i just like sitting down probably can't mod it as much as the pc but you know that's it there you go let me know what you guys think I still want to show this off. It's really cool. Alright. Peace out. Enjoy the game.